कर्नाटक बीजेपी के कानून साज वेद व्यास कामत और वाई भारत शेट्टी और दीगर तीन लोगों के खिलाफ एफआईआर दर्ज की गई है इन पर लोगों को भड़काने और दक्षिण कन्नड़ मंगलुरु में एक स्कूल के तलबा को जय श्री राम का नारा लगाने पर मजबूर करने का इल्जाम है सेंट जिरोसा इंग्लिश हायर प्राइमरी स्कूल की इंतजामिया का कहना है कि कामत ने उनसे वजाहत तलब किए बगैर स्कूल के सामने एहतजाज शुरू कर दिया और तलबा को जय श्री राम का नारा लगाने पर मजबूर किया इस मामले में दो कॉरपोरेटर संदीप गरोडी और भरत कुमार और बजरंग दल लीडर शरण पंपवल के खिलाफ भी मुकदमा दर्ज किया गया है मुजाहरीन पर यह भी इल्जाम है कि उन्होंने एहतजाज के दौरान ईसाइत के खिलाफ नारे लगाकर ईसाई और हिंदू बिरादरियों के दरमियान दुश्मनी को हवा दी है पुलिस का कहना है कि दक्षिण कन्नड़ में फिर खवाराना मसाइल की हिसासियत को देखते हुए मैंगलुरु में इस तरह की कार्रवाई से अमन वमान को मसला हो सकता है लिहाजा इसके खिलाफ सख्त कार्रवाई का मुतालबा करते हुए एफ आई आर दर्ज की गई है फॉल्स एफ आई आर बिन रजिस्टर्ड अगेंस्ट मी एंड अदर एम एल ए वेद कामत टू कॉरपोरेटर्स एंड वन पब्लिक पर्सन ऑल्सो इज नॉट एट ऑल इन्वॉल्व इन ऑल दिस थिंग्स सी वॉट एज हैपन इज द टीचर ऑफ दैट जरोसा कॉलेज हैज मेड सम डेरोगोटरी स्टेटमेंट अबाउट भगवान श्री राम what was what did she make sir? she when well, uh, taking the class uh, by the name work is worship when she was taking that class she has told that uh, you guys seven standard students she has told the students that you guys have raised a mosque and built a temple now you have kept a stone and decorated the stone just by decorating the stone will the god come into that will the rama will be there in that one second thing she has they have been telling that the kumkum the bindi you are wearing it is just powder why are you wearing that all those things and she has gone ahead and told also told that uh, modi ji has killed uh, so many muslims in godra train and uh, 11 hindus have raped one muslim girl in those lines to a 700 kids this is the complaint by the students the students and the parents have come out in the open and they have complained when they have complained i have gone with the students to the zilla panchayat office where the ddpi office is there we have complained to the ddpi and told him that uh, investigation should be done at a neutral place not in the school the students parents and the teacher should be called to a neutral place and do a investigation over there the investigation has started see two things has happened here two nay three things have happened here one is the ddpi the, when the investigation is going on the ddpi has been transferred he is not in his position in between the investigation he has been transferred second thing the uh, parents and the students and the public they have given different complaints to the nearby police station regarding uh, uh, regarding the conversion uh, attempt by all this uh, people the conversion attempt the fir not been has not been registered the fir has been registered against the mls against vedavas kamat is number 1 accused but dr barashetty i am number 2 accused and there are six more people like that now the interesting point is i was not even in the spot i gave the complaint to the ddp office i came to i have a boarding pass with me i have the tickets i have the traveling proof i have come to bangalore i have to attend the assembly i got late because the flight also landed little late but i traveled i was not in the jerusalem school i have not gone to the school me and one more person sharan pampel if not gone near the school also so the people who said jai shri ram they have put cases people who have made derogatory remarks on shri ram they have not been booked not a single case has been filed some of the congress leaders are hinting some mm. of they even did a fact finding committee had gone to the school uh, they however suggest that you know nothing of this uh, sort which went viral through multiple audios was true see the management has taken a u turn why did the management suspend that teacher then they have suspended the teacher they have suspended the teacher a written suspension order was given the student all the students are telling that the investigation is going on you hamper the investigation by transferring the person who is doing the investigation itself and you put a case on mls who are not even in the spot so what is the intention then you don't have the gall to put a case on the teacher who is spreading hatred among children but you have the gall to put a case on a elected representative who was not even in the spot this is why i have taken up the matter in the zero hour 
have placed it before the uh, government. They have to give an explanation by evening. The Home Minister and the Education Minister, whoever is concerned, they will give an explanation. We will have a debate about this again. See, this is the third time, it's uh, third MLA who is getting an FIR in our district. Harish Punja was the first person. They try to stifle our voice. They are trying to curb our voice. Whatever is happening against the Hindus, if you raise a voice, the present dispensation, the present government is trying to kill our voice. But the government statement says, sir, if I am not wrong, they are saying FIR has been filed for the statements which you gave in front of the school. I have a FIR copy. You, you have access to the FIR. No. Jai Shri Ram. You listen to me now. You have the FIR, access to the FIR copy. Read it once. I was not even in the spot. The FIR copy is not even... I, and I have given a statement. I will re-give the statement again. Any school which has anti-Hindu mindset, Hindus should refrain or rethink about sending their children to such schools. I didn't say all the schools. Any schools which has an anti-Hindu mindset. Why we should send the students, our children there, where they will get uh, brainwashed into thinking that their uh, religion, their belief is all, uh, uh, what, uh, third class or something in those lines? That is not fair.